Downtown Fort Wayne is officially lit up for the holiday season. Fox 55's Drew Fry is live from Birdies on top of the Bradley Hotel in downtown Fort Wayne now. He's going to take us through the night of lights. Drew? Yeah, Kelsey, well, we can all debate when the holiday season officially begins. I know we've had this discussion in the newsroom. Some of us may say that it's before Thanksgiving. Others might say you got to wait till the first day of December. Well, behind me, Santa Claus and his reindeer say it starts right now. I'm sitting on top of the Bradley Hotel, but earlier, I, right now I'm overlooking the city, but earlier I was down there in the crowd watching as the night of lights officially kicked off. Take a look at some of the sights and sounds of that. So what you're seeing now is the lighting of Santa and his reindeer outside PNC Bank. Also lighting up the sky tonight, we had Chris Kringle's Village on Main Street, the Parks and Recreation, Santa's Workshop Display, and the Flagstar Christmas Tree. Thousands of families joined in the celebration, and I was able to talk with some of the kids about what makes this season so special. A lot, like with my cousins and stuff about like sports and watching the sail light up. Uh, it really brings everyone together. Like we get to see all our friends and family we don't see normally. Food. Um. <laughs> so that we can spend time with our family. Yeah. Decorate for Thanksgiving and Christmas. Then if you heard a lot of noise coming from the area around 7.30 tonight, that would be the ringing of the bells coming from downtown churches and the public library. The night then concluded with holiday fireworks at Parkview Field. And so while the streets are now still open now, and the crowd has certainly dispersed, Santa won't be leaving that wall anytime soon. So if you've got a holiday list that you need to for and you want to check it once, maybe you want to check it twice, well, you know the place to go to do that. Reporting live in downtown Fort Wayne, I'm Drew Fry, Fox 55 News. All right, thanks so much, Drew. I may or may not be one of those people for after Thanksgiving Christmas, but that's kind of getting me in the spirit now.